Welcome back, y'all. Thanks for joining us. We're gonna get started doing the morning feeding and letting everybody out. Let's roll. Start with the quacky pecky. Quacky pecky. Bo's like, feed me. That one still ain't coming.
close that gate, I'll let the chickens out. The metal gate? Uh, Open the tin? Uh, oh, no, we have the inside of the tin. Oh. In this corner over here. <laughs> Alright, let's go feed. Ooh, I look rough. Let's go feed. Batman, Loudmouth, the Baney Hens, and the Pipsqueak. Hello, old foe. How are you, sir? Colors has changed. <laughs> yeah, just a minute. You're snazzy. That right there with the gold head, it's named Snazzy. Name what? Snazzy. Snazzy. Snazzy lazy. Gather the eggs. Well, I already gathered some eggs. Let's go gather the large chicken eggs. Houston, we have a problem. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I got the spray at the house. 
getting cooler weather. They do better in the cold. Ours do anyway, that's not typical. Typically they need lots of sunshine and stuff to lay good, but Are you still sitting? No. That ain't the same. Uh -huh. I off Did you just get through laying? She ain't laid yet. That tree's still in there. Oh. I'll leave you alone so you can go ahead and do your thing. Oh, it don't make you mad now. Well, sorry. Look at them beauties. Breakfast time, breakfast, Huggy. Breakfast. All right, I'm going to be making a cheesy ham and broccoli quiche. This is my first time making this recipe, so we'll see how it goes. Called for Bisquick, and I didn't have any on hand, so I just looked me up a recipe. Uh, the recipe that I went by. No, Lee, that's enough. <laughs> called for one cup of all-purpose flour, one and a half teaspoons of baking powder, a fourth of a teaspoon of salt, and one tablespoon of butter. Now, if you don't have the butter, you can also use lard. I would recommend if you use the butter, or I probably would do it on both hands. If you make up a bunch of this, I would probably keep it in the freezer. And if you wonder why the freezer, uh, that way if it's anything that could cause it to ruin, it's it's not going to. Also, if you uh, get those little like uh, weevils and stuff like that, it gets in your flour and stuff. If you put it in the freezer, then you won't have to deal with that. That's how I store all my excess flour, cornmeal, and such as that. All right, here's the ingredients we're gonna be using. I need one and a half cups of milk, two tablespoons of melted butter, three eggs, a half a cup of the Bisquick, which you seen me mix up earlier, uh, one teaspoon of salt, a cup of chopped ham, one cup of broccoli, it says chopped in small pieces, I don't have fresh broccoli, so I'm using frozen that I've laid out ahead of time so it can thaw. A cup of shredded cheddar cheese, and it says a cup of American cheese. Guess what? I'm just going to use a cup and a half of shredded cheddar. <laughs> so, let's get this started. We've switched pans because that silicone pan was making it all kind of fold down to the middle and it wouldn't have cooked evenly, so we switched to the old reliable.
volume looks like. Now let's cook some supper. We laid out some wild turkey out of the freezer and cut it up into strips and then put in an egg wash and mixed it up in our own special batter and fried it up and had some sweet potatoes and cheddar broccoli rice and of course some sliced tomatoes. And it was delicious. Are we dancing? La -da -dee, la -da -dee, la -da -dum. Everybody shut up for the night. <laughs> Go back in there. It's easy when they just go up on the road. Mm -hmm. We need more. Now go do your garden. Do your garden. Garden, everybody. Not me. Whoa. Woohoo. Woohoo. All right. Get down. Right. Get down. No. Go play. Go play. Buddy. Good boy. Good. No. Settle down. There you go. I know you just been playful. All that pinned up energy today. But I don't like you jumping on your nails. Good scratch. boy. Good sitting down. Your nails scratch me. Yeah, they do. Your nails scratch. Yeah, they do. They scratch. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> you got the zoomies. Go run them. Go the run them out. He got the twisties. <laughs> All that puppy energy. You oh, getting so big. Calm down. Calm down. Good boy. Good boy. Stay still. You so happy. <laughs> Calm down. Don't get up my bridge leg. Don't get my bridge leg. You're getting so big. Calm down. Hi, oh, buddy. Look. Don't eat the phone. There you go. Go running. Mm -hmm. 
one back there. 33 if I'm right. More yeah, there's more eggs. Don't nobody poop on me. How many did you get this morning? Four. And three right now. Pretty good. Good night. I'll see you good. Since we ain't windy, we need to just push the tube. There you go, boy. There's your supper and late night snack. Keeping the boogers away from the chicken and stuff, ain't you? Yeah. All right, buddy. Good night. Good night. Love you. Good night. You have fun tonight. What? There's two right there. Twelve. Twelve chicken in here. No, you only counted. There's two right there. You counted one of them. Thirteen. Mm -hmm. I thought so. So twelve eggs today from them. Cause wasn't it ten this morning or was it eight? I don't remember. Oh, <laughs> Gotta wash our own vlog to see how many eggs we got. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks for joining us today. You've got a full day of pet near at homesteading. We hope you enjoy it. We'd like to hear from you. Give us a, a thumbs up, good comment, and uh, hope you join us in the next go around. As always, subscribe and we always like to thank the Lord for giving us this life and this opportunity to share it. And we appreciate y'all, and we'll see you next time. Like I always say, maybe next time it'll be a little bit better. Bye! Bye.